WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, Monday morning, 30 minutes to go until the opening bell. And we got markets starting off in positive territory to start the week. Dow futures right now up 104 points, trading 28,881. S&P up 11 points, trading 3,275. NASDAQ 100 futures up 41 points, trading at 9,019. We got some action in gold. The 10 year yield 1.84% right now. And we'll start things off. We're going to check out the VIX this morning. Volatility index hitting 1209 for a low on Friday. A little bit of a raise from that level, 1275 as we start off the trading week. We'll jump over to the charts. We'll start it off with the indices. We'll start it off with the Dow. A little bit of volatility this morning, but pretty muted action. You're only talking about 70 points above from high to low. The Dow up above 28,900 briefly. We trade down to a low of about 28,837, currently trading 28,865. NASDAQ 100 bouncing around in both directions as well. We reach a high just shy of 6 a.m. of 9,026, currently trading 9,015. S&Ps were up at a high of 3,278 this morning, currently trading 3,274. There's your crude oil market, was above $59, just went under that level. You have crude, February contract, trading $58.95. There's your gold contract with volatility in both directions as well. The futures opened last night at about $15.61, pretty much right where we finished last week. You trade all the way down to a low in gold of $15.47, just after 4 a.m. Eastern time this morning. And from there, gold catching a little bit of a bid at $15.55.95. And the euro U.S. dollar trading 111.19. In terms of what else you have happening in the market, the new Boeing CEO taking the helm today. So David Calhoun assumes the job Monday as the U.S. plane maker battles to recover from two fatal crashes of the 737 MAX. We'll see how that plays out as Boeing has a lot to prove to their shareholders and the world and the country. Tesla shares trading higher. It just does not stop for Elon Musk and Tesla. They get an upgrade for, from Oppenheimer as they raise their price target to $612. We'll jump over to that chart in a moment. And Lululemon raising their quarterly forecast after upbeat holiday sales. And Lulu will start it off looking to open about 241, close to 234. Tesla looking to open about 489. Big week of bank earnings. J.P. Morgan kicks it off starting tomorrow. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pesavento coming up at 9. I'll be back at 10 o'clock. Live programming all day at TFNN. We'll be right back. <laughs> 